Hello viewers, 4DIYers here with another tutorial video. In this particular video here, I'll be doing a demonstration on my top 5 tips on how to eliminate odors in your vehicle. As always, if you're not a subscriber, then be sure to hit that subscribe button. If you have enjoyed this video, don't forget to give me a thumbs up. The tips certainly aren't limited to what I've listed in this video. If you have a tip, please feel free to share it in the comments below. All these tips I do have tutorials on, so be sure to check them out for further info. Starting with tip number one, clean your interior. This is probably the best base spot to start with, given your interior a full detail. This includes throwing out any garbage, vacuuming up any debris, especially under the seat or in those tight nooks, wiping down the interior components which may have experienced spillage, and then shampooing the upholstery. Upholstery can suck up those foul smells or soak up food or drinks which can create mold. Moving on to tip number two. This is more specific to cars, but can also be applied to other vehicles with a similar design. Remove your back seat and clean underneath it. These are sometimes bolted in, but for the most part, they simply have clips up front. Give them a pull to disengage the clips and then remove the seat base. Stuff manages to fall between the seat back and base or through the seat belt pockets and has nowhere to go. I have found anything from food to wrappers, money, pens, pencils, and drink spillage under the seat. It's such an overlooked area which doesn't take much work or time to clean. Tip number three, fix any leaks in your vehicle. This can include anywhere from an oil leak, fuel, coolant, exhaust, or water. Depending on the location of the leak, it can be sucked up through the ventilation system, circulated through the interior of the vehicle. My past VW TDI had a cracked EGR pipe, which would end up filling the car's interior with diesel smoke. Sourcing out leaks will vary depending on the source or what it may smell like. Tip number four, replace your cabin filter. Most new vehicles, but not all, are equipped with a cabin filter to help filter exterior air for the occupants. These have suggested maintenance intervals, they need to be checked or replaced. As a generic interval, they should be replaced once a year or 20,000 kilometers or 12,000 miles, but refer to your vehicle's owner's manual first. To further help eliminate odors, specialty filters are available, which are embedded with a deodorizer or a material such as a charcoal. And finally, tip number five. Chemically deodorize your interior, a method that is used by mechanics and detailers. I just recently released an updated version of this video which involves spraying a chemical into your vehicle's ventilation system that helps kill mildew and other foul smells. It's known as an evaporator treatment and an evaporator can have mold or mildew build up. This method can also be used on vehicles without air conditioning as well. This particular method should be left to the last as it won't solve an odor left over from food or dirty upholstery. This isn't an official tip, but other areas which can be a source of a smell may be stains in the vehicle's insulation or foam backing. It may even be a dead animal such as a mouse. Issues like this would involve stripping down the interior for extensive cleaning or replacement. New videos are being released every Monday and Friday, so be sure to stay up to date with my schedule by hitting that notification bell on my channel homepage. Don't forget to leave a comment below letting me know what you think of my tutorial. Thank you for watching.